Uh, hi, um, I used to run this uh, DevTools theme called uh, SO Dark uh, Monokai. Uh, nowadays I'm working with uh, Maurice on uh, this one called Zero Base Themes. Mm. And uh, the way that SO Dark Monokai used to work is that you could go directly to um, this path where this custom CSS lived, and if you changed that, you'd see that reflected in the Chrome DevTools. Um, it works a bit differently now, and what we're trying to do is, um, with zero base themes, is make it so that other people can uh, collaborate and put their own, uh, create their own theme easily, and that everyone can sort of contribute to um, global style sheets that are going to help everyone's theme. Um, and yeah, that's about it. So how you get set up with this is grab a, a copy of it. So. Um, uh, I use some uh, custom aliases here, so that's uh, G for Git and C for Clone. So that's and also O will open it up in Finder. So that's now copied that there. So if I open this up in Sublime Text, um, we've got the themes here. So this is the the default one. Um, Maurice's is there. The zero dark matrix and mine S10 when Monokai. So, um, we come across here in the less folder, and then we've got one for Canary and one for Build. Uh, sorry, Stable. Um, so, here this is going to pull in the Zero Dark Matrix theme. So, after you've done that, you're going to want to uh, go into the directory, do an npm install. Uh, this will get all the awesome grunt stuff. Then when it's done this, we'll do a, a grunt watch, and that'll watch for any changes here. Okay, so if I say change this to mine, which is just uh, when one okay, save that. You can see this uh, now uh, creates these CSS files here. So now what you're going to want to do, come across to Chrome DevTools. Um, so I'm just using the shortcut uh, command alt i for that. And then I'm going to want to come across to settings, uh, extensions, uh, and then you might not see this, but you click this here, you see the developer mode, load unpacked extension, go to where you uh, cloned it, and then go to theme extension, select that, and there you go. You can see that now, uh, show it in the incognito mode as well, have that enabled and then you come back to where it was, if you close it and open it again, there you go. So that's my uh, my theme now. We You can do all sorts of awesome stuff with it and I think it looks great. Um, so if you used to do your own, what you do is, wait up, wait a sec. You take a copy of the theme template, um, save that as your own one. Uh, less. Then go to the if you're using Canary or Stable, and then type it in there, <coughs> and then you can change all these different things. So let's say I don't know. Let's just make all these red just for a second. Hopefully we'll see some stuff change. So if I go to Chrome again, extensions, yeah, that should be there, shouldn't it? So that should automatically reload. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. So that's how easy it is. And you can just change all your styles there, open and close it again, and you'll see the changes. So I hope that helps. Cheers.